Super High Vision is the most advanced moving picture system in the world. Two projectors are used to display the images. The 8K camera weighs about 40 kilograms. It uses four CMOS panels that can take 60 frames a second at a resolution of 8 million pixels. The lens was specially designed to ensure appropriate optical performance. During shooting, Images taken by the camera are first verified and adjusted on 22-inch 4K monitors in an outside broadcasting van. The images are stored in uncompressed form on a hard disk recorder. This new television system is designed for extremely high definition that creates an unprecedented sense of reality. It brings video recording to a whole new level in such fields as sports, science, and nature. Sound is one of the most important factors that helps to close the gap between image and reality and makes people feel as if they have truly entered a different world. Super High Vision's 22.2 multi-channel sound system is especially noteworthy for its three-dimensional sound field. It consists of nine channels in the top layer, ten channels in the middle layer, three channels in the bottom layer, and two low-frequency effects channels. This advanced sound system can freely move the sound images up, down, left, right, forward, and backward, placing them anywhere in the audio field. Multiple microphones are used in the recording process to capture the sound from a variety of angles. The resulting three-dimensional sound works in tandem with the super high vision images to create an amazingly realistic effect. In the future, super high vision will be delivered to the home. With this in mind, New transmission technologies are being developed for super high vision broadcasting. In November 2005, a long distance transmission experiment was conducted, which successfully sent uncompressed super high vision data at a rate of 24 gigabits per second. Experiments are also being conducted on compressed transmissions over IP and satellite links. These technical frontiers are changing television forever.